Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. I'm your host, Fenico. I'm the community manager here at Ultima Online. And you're joining me here today uh, for the stream for EM events. And this is Drakenfels. Uh, Drakenfels is a German server that we have here at Ultima Online. And the EM for this server is... Lyra. So we're going to be joining Lyra today and uh, seeing what Lyra is going to have to offer and fun for us. And yeah, we're just going to have a great time. So before we get started, I just wanted to reiterate, please, if you have anything to say, uh, you want to, you know, talk to me or anything like that, please do not disrupt the EM event. Please do it in the chat here on Twitch. Um, otherwise, you know, let's have some fun. And uh, yeah, we'll just get started with this. I'm going to, uh, poof, there I am. And you can see, now we've got everything going right now. Uh, as you can see on my screen, we have got the journal going so that you can see what's going on. But we're gonna keep uh, close and pay attention to what's going on so we can have a great time. So if you are joining, I know this is a, very interesting time to be streaming. Uh, normally we don't stream at this time typically because most of the uh, the North American events are at night but because this is overseas it is night their time it's daytime our time so that's why the the time difference is a little wacky but uh, I think it's nice an afternoon stream heck yeah I think it's gonna be a good time for everybody. Uh, so, Lieutenant says, good evening, Dragonfells. The event will be starting soon. Moongate's at West Brit Bank, Britain Commons, New Haven, and Luna. So, if you're wondering on how to get here, we are at the Counselor's Hall just before the bridge to Castle Blackthorn. But, you can catch a Moongate at West Brit Bank, Britain Commons, New Haven, or Luna Bank. So that's very nice that there are plenty of means for you to get here to join in on all the fun that we're going to have today. So we're just waiting to get started. But uh, look at all these beautiful people here. Lots and lots of beautiful people. I mean, this is I've never I can say I've never been to a Dragonfell's event. So this is actually going to be a, a big treat for me, especially. So I'm really excited about this. I think it's going to be a blast. And we're going to learn about the story. So, yeah, exciting. I think what's even more exciting is that I I just remembered it's a leap year. I thought tomorrow was the last day of the month. Yeah, I really did. I thought tomorrow was the last day of the month. And I was surprised when everybody kind of went, um, no. And I re that's when I remembered it's a leap year. So if you thought tomorrow was the end of the month, it is not. You've got one more day. Whether that's a good thing or a bad thing, that's for you to decide. But could you imagine if you were born on the 29th? I mean, do you just count the years and celebrate it on the 28th? Or do you go by how many times there is a leap year? Food for thought. All right. It appears we have Lieutenant Gelbendil here. And I'm not going to butcher trying to speak German because I cannot. So uh, we're going to read all of the English parts. Good evening, Dragonfells. It's nice to see you all here again. That is a lovely yellow suit. It's bright. It's very sunshine yellow. I love it. I hope you were able to experience a few romantic days recently. Yes, Valentine's. There's some nice little decorations here celebrating Valentine's. Little hearts. Okay. 
Unfortunately, I haven't had any luck myself this year. Looks a little sad. Oh. Oh, dear. Hmm. But at least I got some good trips or good tips for my future plans. Oh, that's good. That's pretty awesome. All right. All right. Sure. So if there is a little pause and you're seeing thing, you know, words popping up, it's I, I got to wait for the English version. I'm really excited and want to try them out with you. Ooh. Very interesting. So yes, I do apologize if you try to speak to me in German. I, I do not understand. I'm very sorry. But what's very nice about this shard is they do give you the English version. So, and of course, I got a new suit of armor. Grins. It looks snazzy. I love it. Love the yellow. It, it just makes you feel happy. And it kind of matches their shield a little bit. Just saying. Because they got the yellow and the red going on. Heck yeah. And yes, I know the German flag. I know. Takes out a rather crumpled piece of paper and begins to read aloud. Yes, very bright, sunny yellow. I love it. It just makes you feel happy. Hopefully it's sunny wherever you are, too. I know the weather's been kind of crazy everywhere. First, I was told to try to look for a fountain of happiness. Ooh, mumbles. Hmm. Then at a sea of flowers where you can always meet beautiful women. Oh dear. Ponders and frowns. Oh. <laughs> uh ancient one i wouldn't bet on that one and finally at the most musical place in our lands hmm i wouldn't bet on that one <laughs> just saying i would not bet don't place your bets on that <laughs> I think I know all these places. Oh, that's nice. Would you be willing to support me? Well, of course. Lead the way. Lead the way. Let's go. Heck yeah. I know Wunderbar. I knew that one. Wunderbar. I knew that one. Oh, we are in Sweetheart for the chat. So we're going to go into our chat channels. You're going to click on your journal or your chat. And then what we're going to look for is we're going to look for Sweetheart. There we are. And we're going to join that channel. 
There we go. Now we're in the Sweetheart channel. Wonderful. Uh, but before we go, um, use the chat, Sweetheart. So, yeah, if you have any problems, questions, anything like that, use the chat, Sweetheart. So that's actually quite lovely. Oh, pulls on the armor. Ooh. He's just a happy little ray of sunshine today. It's just a happy little ray of sunshine. All right, let's go. Lead on. Follow me, grins. All right. It says, ahem. Let's go. Grins. Lead the way. Yes, and we are in the correct chat. That's wonderful. We just got confirmation. That's a nice little touch. Oh, it's the opposite side, I see. Perhaps. I'm just kind of looking around at this point. They have some lovely gates kind of all over the place. But yeah, that's nice. Okay, there we go. Be careful and good luck. And there it is, a lovely blue gate. It's a beautiful blue. So we're going to go in there. And there are a lot of people. And as we've seen in previous streams, this does happen. So we're going to get right back started again. Like I said, it happens. It's okay. We're going to get right back into it. Don't you worry. Don't you fret. Everything's going to be just fine. And we're going to be back to having a good time. Um, with all the other peoples that are surely there, ready to have a good time too. And just a moment as I get everything kind of reset up again. I want to make sure that Everything's looking nice and snazzy for y'all. There we go. Might have to move things around just a little bit, but you get the gist of it, right? 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 All right. <laughs> All right. We are back. And we are in the midst of fighting here. Oh, my. There are quite a lot of people here, so we are experiencing just a little, a touch of lag there, but it's okay. Um, we're just going to power through, I think. So I'm going to move that up a little bit so you can see things a little bit better. But yeah, you can see everything's kind of going on. So we're going to kind of go through just a little bit and take a look at the scenery. So we've got some a lovely banner, a lovely column. We've got some of these going, and we've got uh, some heart statues with lovely pedestals. And these guys look really nasty looking. So you want to be careful of those, but lots of lovely decor. Oh my goodness, a jealous jerk. Oh dear. Oh my, my, my. Well, that's no good. Be careful now, everybody. Oh, look at that guy. What a mean guy. What a mean guy. He shouldn't be so jealous. And we still have quite a few people here in the beginning where everybody comes in. So we're seeing that go on right now. Otherwise, there's kind of stuff everywhere. There really is no one place where, you know, there's no, quote, safe space. So just saying, you may want to just, you know, 
keep her moving. But yeah, just to give an idea, I know you're seeing all the names that are popping up here, and there is quite a bit of people here this afternoon slash evening, depending on where you are. So there's a lot to be expected with that. I mean, there's a lot of people here to enjoy all the fun. My, my, my. My, my, my. A lot of people. I'm just going to, I'm going to kind of wander a little bit. I'm going to park it right here and I'm going to take a look at what's going on and just kind of watch you guys. I'll be the supervisor. You're doing a great job. <laughs> Everybody's going fantastically. I love it. Good job, everybody. Good job, everybody. My goodness. An avid sake worshiper? Ooh. Wow, look at all the people. Oh my goodness, you're doing a great job though. You're doing an amazing job. Wowie, wow. That's a lot of people. I have to say, that's a lot of people. That's a lot of people. And as you can see, the feed is just kind of really kind of whipping past uh, with all the the spells and what's out there and people moving around and everything. So there's a lot going on right now. So you're not, I mean, right now we're just fighting so far. As far as I can see, we are all just fighting. Um, it looks like what was over here is down. So we're going to kind of move around a little bit. Um, a crazy claw woman. Yeah, crazy claw woman over here. She's kind of bouncing around. So we've got quite a bit all over. Uh, so if you're looking on where you should be, what you should be fighting. I mean, if you go to the north and west, I mean, sorry, north and east, You'll see there's a crazy claw woman over there. So you can go ahead and uh, start attacking that one. I'm going to also kind of take a peek around, see if there's anything else that I can see going on. A lot of people back here. Come on. Get up in here. Come on, everybody. Let's go. You, you got to get involved. You know what I'm saying? You got to get involved here, people got to get out there so yeah it looks like right now we're just attacking this crazy claw woman so hopefully you know we'll get that taken care of so we can keep going you know what I'm saying Look at that. Look at that. So many peoples. My goodness. Everybody's doing such an amazing job. Taking down everything so super fast. Wow. You guys are efficient here. My goodness, you guys are efficient. And don't mind me. I'm just kind of running around trying to get a lay of everything. Okay, we have the lieutenant up here again.
We're just going to see if the lieutenant has anything to say. He's just kind of standing on a bridge right now. If you're curious where you came in, it's just north and very ever so slightly to the east. And if you're wondering on how to get where we are, uh, have you seen these women? He asked. If you're wondering how to get here, go to the counselor's hall. It's right next to Blackthorns. Uh, you can also catch a gate, West Brent Bank. Uh, I do believe they said Britain Commons, Luna Haven. Grab the gate and then near the counselor's hall, right where you end up. If you go, there's a blue gate. And that'll get you here and then just go slightly north and east. Uh, the one with the long claws, I praise the sake fountain here. Chuckles. Hmm. And now the flower bed. Let's go and have a look. All right. Cool beans. Let's go have a look. Let's go take a peek. We've gone to one of the three places. So. Oh, there's that lovely blue gate again. And here we are, again, seeing lovely banners, lovely columns. Oh, some beautiful roses. Oh, dear, look out, an arrogant accomplice, enraged sea beasts. Oh, my goodness, be very careful. An ifrit, a mad kudan. Oh my goodness. Be careful, everyone. That's no good. This is beautiful. I mean, I always I always love the scenery that these EMs come up with. It's it's beautiful. And this is definitely giving me Valentine's vibes yet. which is super cool. And it looks like everyone here has planted some beautiful plants. It's lovely. Dragonfells this year, pretty, 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 pretty beautiful. How about that? All right, my goodness gracious. Just a lot going on, but yes, the decor is snazzy, very snazzy. Ooh, lots of people getting hurt, though. Be careful. All those numbers popping up. Oh, my goodness. Lots of poison. A lot of toxins going on. Oh, that's clever. Go to the other side. That's pretty clever. I love it. Look at that. I love it. Oh, a broken heart sculpture. Oh, that's so sad. A lovely heart sculpture. Oh, it's a broken heart. A broken heart. A glowing heart. I still, I love these 
Stay safe and healthy. I love these flowers. They're beautiful. It's a beautiful bouquet. I love it. I absolutely love it. But then all, look at this. This is, this is what I love about going to the different shards and, and really getting to see everything that each of the shards have to offer is the amount of, you know, things that the players do to kind of make it their own too. So, I mean, this is, Numagentia is a perfect example of that, of, you know, planting in the gardens and really, you know, customizing your shard to you. And it shows the dedication that, you know, the Drakenfels player ha players have to this. And that's, that's amazing. So my hat's off, or my ears off to uh, the Drakenfels players for, for making, you know, everything beautiful for themselves. Cause that's, that's really impressive. And, you know, again, Ears off to, you know, the EM here, EM Lyra. Amazing job. Ab everything's just beautiful. So, yes, please, you know, again, at the end of this, if nothing else, you know, do thank your EMs or thank your, if you're visiting, thank the EM because they work hard. They're rock stars. I've said it a million times. I'll say it a million more. They're absolute rock stars. And you got to, you got to give them that thanks. They don't hear it enough. You know? Oh dear. Someone died. Oh no. Bummer. Bummer. Oh. There's a lot of people. Oof. Oh. Oh. That poor dragon is trying to take on that, uh, Mad Kudan there. You can do it. What's the dragon's name? I'll just call him Alex. You can do it, Alex. You got this. You got this. A lot going on again, but everybody seems to have it pretty well under control. I am really impressed. I am really impressed. Look at that. Way to go, Alex. Everybody's kind of spaced out quite a bit here. My goodness. There's a, there's quite a bit of spacing between people, which is nice. It's good to see, you know, everybody you know, trying to work together on this as best, you know, as best they can. Looks like they're all ganging up on one here. Oh, and he's down. Out for the count. Very good. We're just going to keep, we're going to keep kind of looking and, and making sure we don't miss anything going on. Because I think it's important that we make sure we stay, you know, with the story, pay attention. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to keep kind of looking around. Oh, there's the lieutenant. Here he comes. I'm going to follow, follow the lieutenant here into the crowd, as it were. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello. Oh, my. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. Bows. <laughs> this is, wow, this is a first. That's, that's a 
fun. We have the RPC, you know, the role play character kind of talking. And that's that's nice. We're going to kind of stay in character there. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. All right, so we're going to keep going. And I love, I love, love, love the fact that, you know, it's in, you know, the dual languages. That's amazing. Hats off. I mean, really, that takes a lot. Those Kudan, those cow monsters, have you seen them? How deceitful can you be in such beautiful surroundings? I agree. It's so beautiful. How can you be so... Oof. I don't know. Hmm. It's a good question. It's a fair question. Welcome to the most beautiful garden on Drakenfels. I agree. This is absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. Can not very romantic beings, that's for sure. I agree. And now, on to the musical part. Let's go. Ooh, I wonder where we're going to go next. Music. Hmm. Follow me. And we have a lovely blue gate yet again. We're going to go through that gate. Ta-da! Oh, dear. There's so many people again. Oh, my, 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 my. So we're going to get that working again and get everything back up and running again when you have so many people it it really is difficult to you know manage sometimes and sometimes you hit it at the wrong moment I probably should have waited just a moment or two longer I think if I would have waited a moment or two longer I would have been better off but you know sometimes you live and learn right you absolutely live and learn So we're just going to get everything set up again so that everything is nice and tidy for you all. Because I think that's important. You know, I think that's important. So we're just going to get everything, like I said, together so that we're set. And there we go. I think that's good. Ta-da! Look at that. I got this down to an art. <laughs> so here we are again and we've got some uh, once again some beautiful decor oh my goodness a lusty lurch oh my uh let's see what is this guy here a horned scoundrel oh my goodness my 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 We've got tons of that stuff going on. So, yes. Oh, and we are by Gweno. In loving memory of Gweno. Yes, indeed. So we are by Gweno's grave. And one thing I, I do love is that um, during the course of these EM events is they, they also show you parts of you know the the facets that you might not have known about or ever seen before so I think it, it's great that they can showcase those and and put that into their stories I think that's fantastic I absolutely love that so I, I have to say you know they do they do an amazing job 
they really, really do. They do an amazing job, you know, with with showcasing everything that there is out there, you know, little by little, event by event, you you see a little more, you learn maybe a little bit more about the the lore and the history of Ultima. So, I mean, depending on where you go, I mean, you you could you could learn and see so much. I mean, it's it's great. I love that. And again, it is something that is very unique to us, to Ultima Online, is that we still do these EM events that are run by individual people that, you know, put these together. They use their own imaginations and their own time and everything to come up with these events, to make them magical for everyone, to make them enjoyable. And that's amazing, in my opinion. And I don't, in my, in my experience, I have not seen that anywhere else. And I think it's great that we, that we have these events because it really makes, it really makes Ultima personal to the player in some ways, I think. And uh, if you have never been to one, I highly suggest you go to one. If you're wondering how to get to one, uh, uo.com. And you can look at the event moderators and you can check the calendar and find a day and a time that works for you if you've never been to one uh, or check your home shard. See where there's one available for your home shard. I mean, please check them out. They're fun. They're enjoyable. Yeah, I can't. And, and again, our EMs are absolute rock stars to do this. So please, please, by all means, go to these and tell the EM thank you because they, they work really hard. They really, really do. So we're going to keep going. Looks like everybody's kind of, again, working amazingly together to take down all these baddies around. Look at that. We've got Iolo's banner here. Lots and lots of stuff going on yet. So if you're wondering, go towards uh, Gweno's grave. There is one thing that's being fought over here that, you know, everybody's trying to, you know, work through. So that we can we can move this story along, you know. There we go. They have taken it down successfully. Look at that. Amazing job yet again. And we've got the lieutenant up here. And we're going to stand over here. We're going to listen to what uh, the lieutenant has to say this time. Remember to also give your EM space. Space is important. Space is important. Need to be able to breathe. There we go. There's the lieutenant. And again, if you're just tuning in, uh, yes, it's in German. I cannot speak German. I do not want to butcher the language. This is normally a very tranquil place. Indeed it is. If you're unfamiliar with Gweno, I highly suggest that you look at uh, the wiki. I hope it will be like this soon again. I do too. It's such a lovely place. It's sad, 
but it's lovely. But now we must put an end uh, to all this. Finally. Indeed. Indeed. It is time. I have found a note. Follow me. Indeed. Lead the way. Lead the way and we shall follow. And there goes, there he is. I think that's good luck. Be careful and good luck. I'm learning. Oh my goodness, that is a fiery gate, isn't it? All right, shall we go in? I say we risk it. Whew. Courage don't fail me now. Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness, a skeletal lich. Everybody be careful. Oh my goodness. Well, we must be in the right place. Because I do see the pillars and everything here. Oh my goodness, the spirit of a lost love and a despicable manifestation. Oh my. That's one big manifestation. My goodness does not look happy. Oh dear. It's a lovely shade of pink though. <laughs> not that I'm partial to the color at all. Oh my goodness. That is definitely, it's gonna be a tough one to beat. I believe our players can do it, though. I believe our players can do it. Oh, he's following someone. It's following someone, for sure. I'm just going to grab his bar. Lots of spawn going on in between, too. So if you're looking for something to do, there are plenty. There's plenty out there that you can fight in between, let me tell ya. Oh my goodness, where did it go? There it is. He's so big, how could I miss him? I don't know. Watch out. He is yellow, so if you're not familiar with that that means that you can't hurt him but he sure can hurt you but he is now red and now he's red oh ho, ho. that was a nice touch that was a beautiful touch all right everybody get him get him take him down that was a beautiful touch though i love that that it he went from that pink to that red um showing that okay there was a change in him and i love that very well done that was a nice touch very nice and that's what i mean those those little those little touches you know they they really do make things very interesting and you know very fun so uh, we have some people taking it down yet. There are some, um, you know, if you're not down here, um, I'm not 
I mean, you just, you're going to have to follow it. I'm going to kind of run out a little bit. Ooh, it's tough. Going to make it through. Oh my goodness. Going to make it through. Okay, there we go. Yes, if you're not familiar, we are all right here. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. So we do have some healers, as you can see on my screen. We have a healer there and then uh, to the right. And then we also have a healer to the left. So if you are if you have died and you're not sure where to go, there are some healers that you can get uh, resurrected. Um, again, one of the things that, you know, I get asked uh, is what are some things that I should bring to an EM event? And I would suggest orange petals. They are amazing. They work very well, especially when, you know, things have poison on them. They might not prevent you from getting poison, but it will make it less effective and last just a little less. And then, of course, I highly recommend um, the Undertaker staff. We, we do sell that, but I do recommend it, especially when, as you can see, there is a clump of people you know, on the screen there, an absolute clump of people. And with that being said, I think it's important, you know, that what you have is the Undertaker stuff, because if you die, you are not going to see your body in that mess. Um, even bringing up all object handles, it's going to be a challenge. Whereas you can kind of, you know, come out from this area, walk over here, use the staff, your body will get pulled over here, you can loot it and get right back into it. So Undertaker stuff, I think, is important. Um, you know, Lux statue, always, you know, hit that thing before you come. Luck can't hurt, right? So, um, and finally, there is a vet reward item and it prevents looting. I recommend using that before you come to an EM event, um, just in case. But I recommend using it. So... They have taken it down. How about that? Oh my goodness. It is down. The players once again have won. Was there ever a doubt? I never doubted them for a moment. Oh dear. And yep, again, there's a lot of people, a lot of people, and it does happen. So do keep in mind that, you know, EMs do their absolute best. They are rock stars when it comes to this stuff. But, you know, and what doesn't help also is that we are, you know, I am in North America. They are, you know, in Germany and you know, they're, they're overseas. So for me, I mean, this is, this is quite a challenge, um, especially for, you know, the, uh, you know, the server for me, cause I'm sure I'm lagged. I can't imagine other people, but yeah, I'm lagged as it is. So we're going to go right back and there we are. So like I said, I mean, lag, it's, I, I imagine most of it is because, again, I, I am in North America. This is an overseas, you know, server. So there's some to be expected, too. So we're just kind of looking around. Uh, I'm not sure if people are standing on a gate. Um, I'm just kind of taking a peek, you know, for everybody. Uh, seeing a lot of people recall out right now. So there are quite a lot of healers here, though, if you miss them. There are quite a bit of healers here if, if you did miss them at all. So a lot of people recalling out, which, you know, it makes sense. And depending on, you know, what is going on, you know, we're just going to be patient. We're just going to wait patiently. Just going to keep running around. 
Oh, and there it is. Look at that. There's the moon gate. Ta-da! And we are back. I'm going to take a seat right there. See that? And we're back. How about that? That was a snazzy event. That was snazzy, I think. That was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. I don't know about you, but I thought it was a lot of fun. And we're just going to wait and we're going to see how, you know, the event is wrapped up. Um, yeah, we're just going to, we're going to see how everything wraps up. Every shard is different. So it's nice to see that uniqueness, in my opinion. And some people... see opportunities sometimes. What can I say? I apologize. Oh, there's a shield right next to me. Ooh, a mighty Gargish wooden shield. That's one thing I can say about this game. As many years as I've been, and I've been with UO a very long time, um, I can say, I don't think I've ever seen the same item, unless it's like made like exactly the same, of course. But as far as randomized, I don't think I've ever seen the same thing twice. I don't think I ever have, which is wild, but I don't think I ever have. It's crazy. They're always like 1% off or one number off, or they have one thing and the other one didn't or yeah, crazy. But yes. We had them pop and then leave. All right. Is everybody ready? I'm ready. I hope everybody else is ready because I'm ready to have a good time. I think we're just kind of waiting a little bit to see if more people are going to join in. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh, the armor has, the pieces of armor have come off. So I think we can all breathe now. Pulls off some armor. Indeed, we can all breathe. We can all take a minute. I think that's important. Phew, indeed. <laughs> indeed. That was a rough one. That was definitely a challenging one. But everybody pulled through. I think everybody did beautiful. Uh, Lieutenant says, that was a real brawl. Yes, indeed. Absolutely it was. Yes, everybody survived. Uh, that was a real brawl. I'm afraid love can be quite exhausting. He's not wrong. It can be. Indeed, that is the best part. Smiles. <laughs> I 
I wish I could translate what some people were saying. Unfortunately, I could not. I'll probably have to reconsider. Oh, chuckles. <laughs> And I'm just curious. We're going to take a look at, look at that snazzy armor. Look at that. I hope you were also successful. Oh, look at that. Melodies from the ultimate love song. Aw, that's beautiful. It's a very snazzy red too. I like it. Very nice indeed. So this was a very special event. There was an item that dropped. And again, it is luck of the draw sometimes, you know, you just, yeah. Thanks a lot for all your help today. You, you just, you get lucky sometimes and sometimes you don't. And that's okay. Because we're not here for that. We're here for the story. We're here for the fun. And we're here to support REMs. Wow, that's a lot. I wish you a good rest and stay safe. I see lots of people thanking. Welcome where he says, I'm here for the loot. <laughs> Everybody seems so nice and pleasant here. Until soon, good night. Very nice. Lots of people thanking the EM. I love to see that. Lieutenant smiles. I love to see that. I love to see, you know, so many players, you know, Thanking the, you know, the EMs. That's always. He says, I hope so too. Grins. <laughs> Take care until soon. Indeed. Lots of fun to be had. Lots of fun to be had. And just like that. Poof. <laughs> Just like that. Tis poof. Love it. Love, love, love it. Amazing, amazing. This was a lot of fun. I hope everybody had fun too. Again, I, I know we don't normally, I don't normally do, um, streams during the daytime and I hope I hope to kind of uh normalize it just a little bit more uh at some point uh doing more streams during you know more extended hours I guess throughout the day so that I hope we can accomplish at some point um but it was nice to do an afternoon stream because I think um it's better to, to kind of visit these different shards that aren't, no, you know, normal for, you know, North American uh, people to watch. I think it's great. I think it's great that we, that we do these. Yes, indeed. Twitch TV. Hello. Um, I want to thank you. Um, Welcome Warrior says, cool event. Thanks for sharing. Have a great day all. Yes, indeed. Have a great day. Welcome Warrior. Thank you. Uh, I want to thank you so much for joining me this afternoon, which is absolutely 
crazy to say, you know, this afternoon, but I want to thank you so much for joining me this afternoon. This was a lot of fun. I hope you had fun too. Uh, don't forget to check out uo.com. It's got everything you need to know about what's going on in the realm of Ultima Online. You can check the event uh, moderators uh, link on the website. It's got all the information you need about your events coming up. And, uh, be sure to check out our socials. We've got Facebook. We've got, you know, Twitter. I, I'm not calling it X. We've got Twitter. We've got Instagram. And then finally, the official forums. Uh, great places where you can share and join in on everything that's going on in the realm of Ultima Online. So be sure to check all those avenues out because I think I think it's great, um, the community that we have and uh, the help that everybody loves to give each other. I think it's fantastic. So let's keep that going. In the meantime, again, I want to thank you again for joining me. I hope you have a great day evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. I hope you all stay safe and uh, you know what? Be good to each other. It's important. I'll see you again real soon. Bye now.